Okay, here it is in my garage. The new KTM 150 XCW TPI. Model year 2020. First brand new bike I've got and I wanted to show you. I don't know much about these things other than it seems to be exactly what I'm gonna be needing to do pair scrambles with after riding a motocross bike for a couple of years doing that. There's a bunch of new things that they did with the bike this year. Um, from my understanding, they've got a whole new engine and uh, comes with a skid plate. There is uh, a new pipe. It looks more like the 250 and 450 pipes versus the 2019 150 pipes that are out there. This has the TPI on it, the second generation TPI, which means you don't have to pre-mix fuel. And there's a fuel, fuel cap with the quarter turn uh, feature and then the same with the oil cap. One thing I did learn is fill the oil slowly it's kind of a, a narrow opening down there and the oil can kind of back up on you if you go too quickly with it. There has been some concern in the past with uh, oil injection on these bikes and the cylinder becoming scored on first startup. And what some people have done is a slight bit of premix in the fuel in order to make sure there's lubrication at all times. I'm doing the same thing just as a precaution. One ounce per gallon is what I'm going to do. But they do have a little electronic delete that comes with the packet um, with the booklet and the instructions. If I can get to them over here. this little piece right here you take the seat up you remove the ECM cover you plug that in before first start up to make sure you're, um, there's no fuel going to the bike but it starts the oil pump and what you do is this oil line that's here you can make sure that it gets pumped full of oil and there's no air bubbles before your first start and hopefully that'll prevent any scoring in the cylinder um, so hopefully that's going to be taking care of any premature, um, you know, rebuilds, I guess. Um, it's got an 18-inch rear wheel. The hand guards, uh, I did order some metal hand guards that will wrap around and you know, protect me on the trees a little bit better because during the races, you can get bumped around quite a bit and uh, I don't want to break the levers or my fingers in the process. Here's Schwark, <laughs> coming to do the inaugural ride on the bike. Holy Lord, we these bikes in here. Yeah, nice, huh? We got Bussard's bikes, my other bike, and the never been ridden, started once. <laughs> 150, it's got a electric start, and the redundant kickstart. So I'm a fan of that because I don't trust batteries. I guess they put the skid plate on because there's a bigger starter down here than what they used to have on the older model. So included. So we're gonna give it a ride today. See what we think of it. Gotta go through the break-in period. I did read the manual on that. It says no more than 70% of throttle for the first three hours and then for the next two hours no more than or less than 100 percent of throttle and then you can tear into it after that change the fluids beforehand though that's it the 2020 ktm 150 xcw tpi